know what you're doing here. My name is Lisa. And I normally work at Alamy Library. I'm here today to put a book to deliver to a great big session. And we're going to have lots of songs and rhymes today and a play as well. Okay? Um, so I say hello to Bootbug. Say hi, hello Bootbug. And Bootbug's brought his friend Bear today. Is Bear going to be joining in with our songs and rhymes? Yeah. Oh, that's brilliant. Are there going to be some special Bear songs and rhymes? Uh huh. Is that right, Bear? Yep, they're all ready to go. So what we're going to do is going, we're going to start with our hello song for the babies, the toddlers and the grown-ups. So if we just sit there down here, and we'll get ready. One, two, three. Hello everyone, hello everyone, glad that you could come. Hello everyone, hello everyone, glad that you could come. Ay, 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 glad that you could come. Say, hello, Big Bug. Hello. Hello, Lisa. Hello. Hello, babies. Hello, babies. Hello, toddlers. Hello, toddlers. Hello, children. And hello, grown ups. I think we're all ready to go. Shall we start with one of our favourite rhymes? I think we'll do cross cross. First, we'll do it. Baby style, are we ready? One, two, three. Cross, cross, line, line. Spiders crawling up your spine. Come, Breeze. Tight squeeze. Now you've got the shivers. Did you like that? Right, shall we do it the other way around now? For the bigger children. Ready? One, two, three. Cross, cross, line, line. Spiders crawling up your spine. Cool breeze. Tight squeeze. Now you've got the shivers. Okay, shall we do it with bear? Oh, it's Bear wants to do the action. So, ready? One, two, three. Cross, cross, line, line. Spiders or a bear crawling up your spine. Go, Breeze. Tight squeeze. Now you've got the shivers. Okay. We're nice and warmed up now. I think we'll do a little tickle, okay? And what better tickle to do with a bear than round and round the garden? Right, are we ready? One, two, three. Round and round the garden like a teddy bear. One step, two step, and a tickle it under there. I bet you don't think Bear was going to do that. I think Bear's got a few more tricks up his sleeve today. Right, are we ready to do this again? Shall we do it the other hand? One, two, three. Round and round the garden like a teddy bear. One step, two step, and a tickly under there. Oh, I didn't realise you were that tickly, bit bug. Is that fun? I think bear and bit bug had a good time. Shall we do something else? Shall we do a little song for Bear? I don't think you'll know this song, so I'll sing it a couple of times. Um, and Bear will do the action for you. I used to sing this when I was a little girl, so it's one of my favourites. It's very, very simple, and it goes. The bear went over the mountain. The bear went over the mountain. The bear went over the mountain. And what do you think he saw? And what do you think he saw? And what do you think he saw? Big 
other side of the mountain, the other side of the mountain, the other side of the mountain, and that is what he saw. Is that fun? We do it again. Did you have fun going over the mountain? Big bug was the mountain. Oh, my goodness. Right, one, two, three. The bear went over the mountain. The bear went over the mountain. The bear went over the mountain to see what he could see. And what do you think he saw? And what do you think he saw? The other side of the mountain. The other side of the mountain. The other side of the mountain. And that is what he saw. Well, it's obvious. You go over a mountain, you see the other side of the mountain. Okay. I think it's time that we look in our magic bag. Okay, should we just set Bear down here? And we'll have a look in our bag. We'll sing our bag song to make it more exciting. One, two, three. What have we got in the bag today? The bag today. The bag today. What have we got in the bag today? Let's see what is inside. What's inside? Oh, it's Baba Black Sheep. It's Baba Black Sheep. You love this song, don't you, Big Bug? Okay, and I hope you all know it, because if you don't know it, um, we'll sing it through a couple of times. Okay, and we'll sing it for all you children out there. Okay, ready? One, two, three. Ba, ba, black sheep, have you any wool? Yes, sir, yes, sir. Three bags full. One for the master, and one for the sea, and one for the children who live down the lane. Did you manage to count all that out, Big Bug? Okay, we'll do it again for some more practice. One, two, three. Ba, ba, black sheep, have you any wool? Yes, sir, yes, sir. Three bags full, one for the master, and one for the sea, and one for the children who live down the lane. Well done, yay! Thank you, Baba Black Sheep. That was one of our favourite rhymes. We'll just sit you down with beer just now, so you can enjoy the rest of the session with us. Right, I think we are ready for a couple of rounds to do toast in the toaster. I love toast in the toaster. I love toast. So, even better. What do you like in your toast boot bug? Nutella. Yeah. Good call. Yeah. I like Nutella on my toast and butter on my toast. And I also like roasted cheese. Oh, this is making me hungry. I'd better stop talking about it. Right. Okay, we ready? One, two, three. I'm toasting the toaster. I'm getting very hot. Tick, tock, tick, tock. Ah! I'm hot. <laughs> you didn't expect that, did you, Big Bug? Right, should we do it again? One, two, three. I'm toasting the toaster. I'm getting very hot. Tick, tock, tick. I thought, that's fantastic. Should we do it the other way around? Okay, you pretend you're the baby this time, but bug. Ready, we'll keep our tight hold of you. Be ready, gentle. One, two, three. I'm toasting the toaster. I'm getting very hot. Tick, tock, tick, tock. Up. Ah! I thought. One more time. Did you like that? Okay. And you're still thinking about your toast, aren't you? Okay, one, two, three. I'm toast 
done my chapter. I'm getting very hot. Hi, Paul. Oh, big bug. That was great fun. See? You ready for another bounce? I'll just put you in a bouncy mood. Okay. We'll do one that I haven't done for a while. Um, but yeah, it's quite wibbly wobbly, so it's good fun. Okay. And it's called, funnily enough, From Wibbleton to Bobbleton. Okay, so we'll have big bug face in here. Okay, are we ready? Holding you securely. And it goes from Wibbleton to Wobbleton. It's 15 miles. From Wobbleton to Wibbleton is 15 miles. From Wibbleton to Wobbleton. From Wobbleton to Wibbleton. From Wibbleton to Wobbleton is 15 miles. <gasps> Did that make you feel a bit wibbly wobbly? Okay. From Wibbleton to Wobbleton is 15 miles. From Wobbleton to Wibbleton is 15 miles. From Wibbleton to Wobbleton, from Wobbleton to Wibbleton, from Wibbleton to Wobbleton is 15 miles. Now, if you're a big child or a toddler, you might want to go a little bit faster. Okay, but if you've got a baby, just let's just keep this a little bit sedate. The last one is purely for the bigger kids. Okay, one, two, three. From Wibbleton to Wobbleton is 15 miles. From Wobbleton to Wibbleton is 15 miles. From Wibbleton to Wobbleton. From Wobbleton to Wibbleton. From Wibbleton to Wobbleton is 15 miles. Whew. Okay, right, we'll do a nice, slow, steady one for the babies. Okay, we're ready. One more time. One, two, three. From Wibbleton to Wobbleton is 15 miles. From Wobbleton to Wibbleton is 15 miles. From Wibbleton to Wobbleton, from Wobbleton to Wibbleton, from Wibbleton to Wobbleton is 15 miles. And I think that's enough excitement for one day, isn't it, Boot Bug? No, just kidding. Because we've been wibbly wobbly, I think we'll do jelly on a plate. Okay, we're ready. Right, we'll do your two favourite verses. We'll do jelly on a plate. And we'll do Sissy's in the jar. Mm -hmm. Yeah, those are his favourites. Right, one, two, three. Jelly on a plate, jelly on a plate. Wibble, wobble, wibble, wobble, jelly on a plate. Woo! Sweeties in the jar. What are your favourite sweeties? Jelly babies. Yeah. Okay, think about all the jelly babies. One, two, three. Sweeties in the jar, sweeties in the jar, shake them up, shake them up, sweeties in the jar, whee! Let's do that again, okay, right, ready for the jelly on a plate, strawberry jelly on a plate, yep, with ice cream, oh that's getting too messy, okay, one, two, three, jelly on a plate, jelly on a plate, Wibble, wobble, 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 jelly on a plate. Whee! Sweeties in the jar, sweeties in the jar. Shake them up, shake them up, sweeties in the jar. Whee! Yes, so you had enough excitement there. I think we'll calm things down with a story. Are we ready? I'll just sit you here. Settle down, bear, and Baba Blushy. And we'll have our story. And today's story is a counting story. And it's called, I'll get it for you later on, Tip Tap with the Crab. And it's written and illustrated by Tim Hopgood. And it's published by Macmillan, who has very kindly allowed us to read their books out for Book Bug Story Time at some time being, so let's make the most of it. I do love a story, an underwater sea story with fish and sea creatures. I love that colour blue, isn't it beautiful? Doesn't make you think of the summer. Let's hope we get a lovely summer with blue seas and blue skies. So are we ready? Tip tap!
place the crab. Well, there's a little footnote here that says, Crabs have ten legs, eight back legs and two more at the front. They have grasping claws called pincers. Ouch. If you see a crab down the beach or in a rock pool, just you be careful to stay out the way of those pincers. Okay. Once there was a crab who lived under a stone in a little rock pool. The pool was beautiful. It was full of colourful shells, strange looking plants and tiny sea creatures. But the little crab had grown tired of her rock pool. The big blue sea is the place for me, she thought. So off she went for a sideways walk. Tip tap went the crab past one noisy seagull standing on a rock. Bet we live in the air and think we know what the noisy seagull sounds like. Tip tap went the crab past two sleepy sea lions dozing in the sun. Oh yeah, that sounds good doesn't it? Tip tap went the crab past three pointy starfish washed up, washed up on the shore. We're getting into the bigger numbers now I think we'll start counting. One, two, three. Tip tap splash went the crab sideways into the big blue sea. The little crab stopped to look all around. She saw four funny octopuses wriggling in the water. One, two, three, four. And five dancing jellyfish that bobbed up and down. One, two, three, four, five. Tip tap went the crab past six swimming turtles that paddled round and round. One, two, three, four, five, six. And, oh how lovely, seven fluttering seahorses that floated through the reefs. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. The little crab watched as a show of eight fish swished left and then right. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. The big blue sea is wonderful, she thought. There's so much to see. But as she marched on, the water became fuller and darker. Tip tap, tip tap went the crab as quietly as she could past nine violent sharks at the bottom of the sea. At last, she came to a tip-tap stop. This is it, thought the crab. The perfect spot. Oh, can you see what it is? It's a treasure chest. But after a while, she began to miss her little rock pool. She missed the colourful shells, strange-looking plants and tiny sea creatures. The big blue sea isn't for me, thought the little crab. It was time to tip tap off. We're ready to tip tap off. But this time she was followed by ten tiny crabs. Shall we count them? Ten tiny crabs, how cute. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. And they all walked sideways, just like their mum. Tip tap, tip tap, tip tip tap. Now, little crabs back in her rock pool with her ten tiny crabs and all her plants and sea creatures. Do you think a crab has a lovely adventure in the deep sea? Apart from the sharks, obviously. It would have been amazing to see the sharks, but pretty dangerous. 
And one final beautiful illustration, a lovely seahorse. Aren't seahorses pretty? I think so. Did you jo enjoy that book, Bug? Did you enjoy it, Bear? Come up and tell me. Oh, uh, book Bug loved it. What was your favourite bit? Ten tiny crabs. I think they're all in agreement. Yep. Let's put you two down. And are we ready for a bit of an action rhyme? I think so. Do you know something? I think we need bear for this one. I told you there was going to be lots of bear today. Right. Are we ready for some teddy bear is up? I love teddy bear is up. We ready? One, two, three. Teddy bear is up. Teddy bear is down. Teddy bear is dancing all around the town. Teddy bear is up. Oh, teddy bear is down. Teddy bear is dancing all around the town. One more. Teddy bear is up. Oh, teddy bear is down. Teddy bear is dancing all around the town. One more. I think so. Make it a good one. Teddy bear is up. Oh, teddy bear is down. Teddy bear is dancing all around the town. Well done, you two. Did you enjoy that, Teddy? You did. Well done, book bug, for helping Teddy out there. Right, I think it's time to look in the bag again. Right, are we ready for our song? You hold on tight to that bag, book bug. What have we got in the bag today? The bag today, the bag. Today. What have we got in the bag today? Let's have a look inside. Look inside. We've got a little card. We've got a little card. Do you like this card? What do you want to sing? Do you want to sing Twinkle Twinkle Chocolate Bar? Let's do it. I always get the words mixed up for this, but we'll try our best. Okay. Right. It's like Twinkle Twinkle Little Star, but it's about a rusty car. This doesn't look very rusty, but we'll sing it anyway. You might not know this one, so we'll sing it through and then we'll sing it again. Okay, one. Twinkle, twinkle, chocolate bar, your dad's got a rusty car. Press the starter, pull the choke, drive away in a cloud of smoke. Twinkle, twinkle, chocolate bar, your dad drives a rusty car. That's a bit cheeky. We're telling everybody at home that their dad drives a rusty car. Maybe he does. Maybe he's got a nice shiny new car. But you like that song because it mentions chocolate bars. Yeah, so let's go. And cars. You like this car, don't you? You go, hmm, hmm. Right, we're ready. One, two, three. Twinkle, twinkle, chocolate bar. Your dad drives a rusty car. Press the starter, pull the choke. Drive away in a cloud of smoke. Twinkle, twinkle, chocolate bar. Your dad drives a rusty car. I think we made everyone at home feel a bit paranoid about their rusty cars. It was just a bit of fun. Okay, we'll put our car down. I think we'll have a bounce. Do one of Book Bug's favourite bounces. We'll do Diddly Diddly D. Right, are we ready? One, two, three. Diddly Diddly D. I bounce you on my knee. Diddly Diddly O. Wait for it. I bounce you down below. Where did you go? <gasps> no. Diddly Diddly I. I bounce you way up high. Diddly Diddly Do. I love. You. Right, we're ready to do that again. 
Here you're facing me last time. One, two, three. Deadly, deadly D. I bounce you on my knee. Deadly, deadly O. I bounce you down below. Deadly, deadly I. I bounce you way up high. Deadly, deadly do. I love you. I do bit bug, because you're very cuddly. Right, I think it's getting near the time to finish, so we'll do a little prose pause and we'll sing our goodbye song. Have you had lots of fun today, book bug? Uh huh. Right, okay. And now we're doing like another of your favourites, cross, cross. Ready? One, two, three. Cross, cross, line, line. Spiders crawling up your spine. Go breeze. Right, squeeze. Now you've got the shimmeries. Okay, and the other way. One, two, three. Cross, cross, line, line. Spiders crawling up your spine. Go breeze. Tight squeeze. Now you've got the shimmeries. It's a good shiver to end up on. Okay, right. Time to say goodbye. So we'll sing our goodbye song for everybody at home. It's been lovely having you. Bitbug and Bear and Baba Black Sheep have had loads of fun. I've had loads of fun and I hope you have too. So let's sing our goodbye song. One, two, three. Goodbye, baby. Goodbye, baby. Goodbye, baby. Have a lovely day. Goodbye, children. Goodbye, children. Goodbye, children. Have a lovely day. Goodbye, grown ups. Sorry about the car. Goodbye, grown ups. Goodbye, grown ups. Have a lovely day. It's goodbye from me. Goodbye from Bookbug. Hope to see you soon. Had brilliant fun. Have a great day. Bye.